Two, what's up? Got the dogs out for a little second, man. Wanna give y'all a little quick update on the dogs, man. Um, I may or may not be on YouTube a lot more lately. Well, coming in the coming weeks or whatever. Probably gonna take a little break, man. I really just been chilling and really been enjoying this. So, uh, channel still been growing, so I mean, y'all can always go back and watch old video. It's always new subscribers coming back or come well coming to the channel and stuff um with that being said this boy right here gonna be end up he gonna end up getting fixed um uh he gonna be in a pet home because he's he's not fit to be bred so we just decided to go ahead and get him fixed that's cobra uh he about seven probably going on i think he's seven months now something like that i mean you can go back in the old videos and see him um but he gonna be getting pet home that's his mama right there and his dad is a uh, type R. I post a picture of him. Uh, just looking for a good pet home for him. Um, reason being is his spine is not correctly aligned. I mean, if you know me, I try to be 100% on everything that we let go or anything, you know, try to rehome or anything. So, uh, yeah, his spine is not correct. So, he's not a breeding dog, basically. I don't want to pass that, pass that down. Cause he always kind of had a little hump in his in his um in his back, but never really just paid it too much mind or anything. So um, <coughs> went in and got him an X-ray, and it's it's showing like a, a little arch in his back. I mean, it ain't nothing super serious. He's still functioning, so he play, run around, and all that good stuff. So um, really, that's mainly it. This dude right here got real bad skin problems, so um, he getting a little better. Uh, we do give him a little Benadryl. When need be, but he got a big old patch because he go to scratching on it. So, stop. Go to scratching on this stuff. Uh, she kind of breaking out a little bit, but she don't scratch as much as him. Uh, like I said, we didn't switch them over to diamond, and uh, you can see them little little uh, rises on them on his skin. But yeah, that's the only one that really got bad. I put a little um, new stock on it, and that's I mean it was raw, so that fur be growing back in probably about another two weeks or so. But um, like I said, man, we're really just kind of chilling out, man. Uh, since we got the new crib, man, I really just been chilling, as y'all can tell, man. It ain't really much going on, like I always say. But at the same time, I mean, I'm just enjoying the dogs, man. I don't really think to pull the phone out no more and all that stuff. So, I mean, it is what it is. Uh, I can't live my life on the internet and all that stuff. So, I try to post when I can and all that, man, and let y'all see updates on the dogs. But I mean, we moving a little different now. Um, these two girls right here really gonna be the face of the, of our bullies for the most part. I mean, like I said, my uh, as far as writing your face, uh, the face of a dynasty bull is basically they gonna produce us the dogs that we want that we want to have on the camp. So for show sure, rain, that's gonna be our first time actually using a production to breed to. Cause I mean, we've been breeding for a while, but we never really got females. And if we did, something always happened or we was doing putbacks and the only female we got was gone. So, um, <clears throat> we just not getting to do a, a, a second generation. And then you don't really just want to be breeding any, any female either. We didn't have females like Rose. Uh, she was a nice, fe she a nice female, but at the same time, she wasn't what we wanted to move forward with, with our program. I mean, I know a lot of people be trying to get quick you know, go quick and make you a second, third generation and stuff, which, I mean, that's fine. But at the same time, I really, with, with us, we actually want to have a foundation that's really going to be something, you know, that we want to keep. Uh, I don't want to breed no dogs that I don't want to keep, so, I mean, it's really simple as that. I mean, it's really a simple concept, but a lot of people be, I ain't even going to say money hungry, but just trying to move too fast. Not saying that's really why they be doing it or whatever, but to me, you just... What we gonna do is we wanna we we don't wanna move so fast and just trying to create generation and not you know end up let, letting a lot of stuff go. Which is with her we gonna tighten up on that blood that she come from, which is Rocco blood. So uh, just to give y'all gist of what she gonna be going to. Like I said, y'all seen the stud. I was supposed to use them before, but um, I really had locked them in for it, hopefully hoping we would have got a female. Any female off of this litter would have been good for them. So. Um, we just gonna go ahead and use it on, on, on rain. Uh, this little 
a little pinky right here, man. That girl coming along pretty good, man. She was sitting out sunbathing early. Her and Nika, when I was out here cutting the yard, man, I really couldn't. Obviously, I was cutting the yard, so I couldn't get no good footage of them. But she coming along real nice, man. Keeping a real, not real slim, but keeping her at a good weight. So her bones and stuff can develop and stuff. But you can kind of, you can see that hump in his back right there. Like I was talking about early. But, um, I mean, hey. I ain't, I, I mean, at least I notice it and, and don't keep continuing with it, man. A lot of people still breed the dog and, you know, I don't know where that came from, stuff like that, you know. Um, but like I say, man, we only trying to produce good dogs and trying to get better, man, at the end of the day. And like I say, man, I'm really, I want to post vi videos, but like I say, uh, out here it take a while to upload videos and at the same time, I really just be chilling. Um, but yeah, man, I ain't finna hold y'all too long because I'm really, I'm really kind of tired, as you can tell in my voice and stuff. But um, I got two breedings for sure. I'm gonna do with her two more breedings for sure. Um, I doubt, I doubt we really get a third one out of. Like most females, when you get them, one or two breedings should get you where you're going. You got a nice breed lined up for her. Um. Might take her to the same stud or not, man. I don't know. It's it's off of the blood that she on. Uh, we're going to for sure get lilacs because she lilac. And uh, we're taking her to a lilac. Matter of fact, a lilac Merle. So, I mean, just to let you know. Because just in case I don't get back on her, I'm probably going to just post updates of when we get everything together, man. Like I said, we got a, a starting group. And, I mean, if y'all comment below if y'all actually want to, you know, just keep seeing these dogs right now. Uh, I really ain't in, in no teaching mood and stuff, so most of the videos is gonna be updating y'all. Um, honestly, I mean, it is what it is with the channel and stuff. Man, I do appreciate everybody that subscribed to the channel, man. Uh, it's growing every day, and people coming on, on older videos, which is mostly the, the Merle video, because I mean, you know, people, a lot of people just love Merle right now. So, I mean, if you subscribe, man, go back and check out all the other videos of all the other dogs too. Because at the end of the day, that girl right there going to be the, like I said, she's going to be the face of Dynasty Bull. I always wanted to have a female kennel, so it's, it's plenty of studs out there. And we're going to produce a stud off her as well as females. If she give us females, man, it's going to be a plus. Um, but other than that, man, I ain't going to hold y'all, man. It's already going on about eight minutes. Try to keep my videos a little short when I do do them. Because I really, you know. Just be showing, trying to show y'all the dogs, man, when I can. And let y'all see them moving around. Because a lot of people use studs and get dogs off of dogs where they just see pictures of them. I just want to get y'all a full look at them before I get off and stuff. As long as me, as well as me talking, man. If y'all don't like how I talk, man, mute the video and still watch it. <laughs> uh, I apologize for the commercials because I've been watching YouTube, man. Those commercials be killing me, man. Even if I take the commercials off of them, they still gonna play a commercial, so unless you got that um that premium or whatever. And even if you got it, I mean, you know. Well, if you got it, it's gonna take it off. So regardless, you probably not even watching commercials if you got the premium. But like I say, man, this girl gonna do some big things too. Get that little color in there and some good blood. She a uh, two two time local LV, and like I said, she got a uh, candy man in her too. Uh, which I think I thank you all for local LV. It's kind of a newer blood to me. But we got to have some blood to outcross, too. So, like I said, with that Rocco stuff, uh, we, we we putting together some stuff, man. We ain't just overnight breeders or nothing. Um, we going to make it work. So we can have uh, so we can have different looks. Well, a tighter look. And then not get too inbred or line bred. You know, once you go too much, like even with the French, you don't want to, especially with the French, you don't want to uh, line breed too much with them. Cause they already got an established look. It's only so many looks you really can get with a Frenchie. Just being honest with you. Cause like I said, you could do Frenchie breedings over and over and still make you something damn that different every time. Or well, it's really gonna be the same but a little different. But like I said, man, I ain't gonna hold y'all, man. Just wanted to show y'all the dogs real quick. I know I hadn't posted the video in a minute. Uh, I've been getting some good. Well, I got some good pictures of them today. So stay tuned to the Instagram channel, man. I mean Instagram page. Uh, if you follow us on Instagram, if not, man, stay around. I'm going to be posting the same pictures on here, too. Uh, so you ain't got to rush and get you, get you no Instagram account or nothing. So, uh, 
But yeah, man, this is Tony and Dynasty Bulls, man. Checking in and checking out, man. I uh, hope y'all having a good day, man. Uh, enjoy y'all Labor Day. I think it'll be coming up in the next week, just in case I don't get back on here by the end. But you never know. I might get a couple drinks in me and get up on here <laughs> on Labor Day since I'll be chilling. Uh, trying to cut back on that, too. So just trying to turn over a new leaf on some stuff. But y'all have a good one, man. Appreciate y'all for watching the channel, man. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit, hit that subscribe button for me.